Hey everybody, it's Multi Classic Gamer here, welcoming you back to more Let's Play Donkey Kong 64. Um, I believe we ended off the previous recording session where um, we did the barrel blasting course of Fungi Force with uh, Donkey Kong. And uh, yeah, when I got Tiny's Splat over there, I forgot to get that banana bloom that was there, but I'm glad I got it just in time before recording this episode. <coughs> Uh, for the most part, I'm thinking that within these next six episodes, we should be able to finish off uh, Fungi Forest. And uh, this next this next week is going to be Thanksgiving week, and it's also going to be November 25th. is going to be the my two year anniversary here on YouTube. And honestly, I have no intention of really celebrating that. I don't. It's just two years I've been on YouTube. There's nothing really special about it. You know, like, we all know that my first year on YouTube, I had, you know, very poor recording quality because I had to use a camera and point at my TV screen. And then my second year is where I finally got this capture card, Dazzle. And so now I can record like this, which is, which I find to be very, very good. What am I doing? I want Diddy Kong. That's why, that's who I want out. Because just inside this, uh, this next part of the... The giant mushroom that we are scaling is Diddy Kong's Kasplat, as well as seven, I think, of his bananas circling around this little area here. I don't know. I think um, Diddy a uh, tiny Kasplat for Fungi Forest could be the biggest Kasplat in the game. You know, like, did you guys see how big that thing was? I don't know about you, I think that was the biggest Kasplat in the entire game. And why? I have no idea. That's completely random because Kasplat to be really big. It would make more sense if Chunky's Kasplats were bigger. Because Chunky's bigger. But anyway... Now we're gonna get Chunky out because when you're scaling the this giant mushroom here, um, you're gonna find a lot of Chunky's... Chunky's bananas, you know, in the pathways as you're going up, so. <clears throat> so we have a trail of bananas here, going up the slider. And watch out for these um these gaps right here that you're not gonna be able to see, chances are. Just be careful when you're going through here because it's so dark that it's hard to tell the gap. And it's actually ironic there that the the bee made me fall through. Because I actually saw it and it and yeah, it still somehow fell through, so that was really weird. These bees are really starting to annoy me. Makes sense that there are a lot more of them than there would be in a regular world, but since it's a I mean uh, since it's a forest. And there are probably a lot, a lot of them in Jungle Japes as well. But I don't know about Fungi Forest. Oh yeah, also, um, about this ladder, okay? You're probably wondering, hey, what? why the hell won't, won't the Kong grab onto the ladder? Well, that's because you have to climb up from the other side. Which makes no sense at all, because it's darker. But that's where the bananas are. And plus, if you climb up on the other side... Okay, this is getting annoying. This is getting really, really annoying. Freaking hate those bees. Who would have thought that climbing the mushroom would be the hardest part of this entire level for me? But I doubt it will be. Because there's something in this world. Oh, 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 I can tell you. That is gonna take the cake. That. That one little mission is just so, so awful. Well, I wouldn't say awful. It's more like, um, nearly impossible, more like. And you'll see why once we get to it. But thankfully for me, you can't actually do it when you first go through fung Fungi Forest, you see. Because, basically, you need Lanky's um, barrel move. You know, where he jumps into a barrel, and then something will... You know, alt something something about him will alter. You know that kind of thing. You know, like how um, D 
Diddy Kong Sparrow made him get the jet packs. Um, Chunky's makes him bigger, Tiny's make her, makes her smaller. Well, that kind of barrel move is, so, is what we don't have for Lanky yet. And we're not going to get that until World 6, so we can't do that mission just yet, because we need, we need Lanky's move from the barrel. And we can't do that yet. <clears throat> so yeah, I'm kind of lucky about that, I and mean, we won't have to do that mission until after World 6, which is going to be my least favorite world in the game. So you guys will probably enjoy watching me go through that. And you will also enjoy watching me do that really, really hard mission here in Fungi Forest. Even though you have to wait until I clear World 6 to do that. So too bad. Ha ha. No, not really. Is that like a third banana mill we've got since we started this episode? Wow. That's probably my new new record for banana mills in one episode. Okay, so we are now at the top of the mushroom. And get Donkey Kong out because we're about to get his the last of his bananas. Up here. At the very top. Okay, so we now have all of Donkey Kong's bananas, and if you take this banana port, it'll take you to the very bottom of the mushroom, okay? Over here with this tag barrel. So, basically now you don't have to climb all the way to the top of the mushroom, now you can just take this banana port here. Okay, next we're going to get... I guess the game wants us to get Diddy Kong out next because there seems to be a bunch of his bananas here. How did I not get that ammo thing? I went right through it. That was weird. Oh, also, um, right here, under this little um, pad here that you cannot access until nighttime, is the the battle crown. I mean, the battle pad for yeah, the K. Roll battle pad for Fungi Forest. And assuming the game doesn't want you to go down there unless it's nighttime, right? Well, guess what? First, let's get Diddy Kong out. Well, guess what? Screw you, Miyamoto. We're gonna get it now. Haha. -ha. Glitched our way down here, even though it's daytime. So let's do the Garabao Crown for World 5. Kamikaze Kremlings. Okay, so I guess it's one Kremling and then two Kasplats. So. Okay, I'm pretty tricky unless you can use a shockwave move, and we got 31 crystal coconuts, we got plenty for the minute that we're here, I guess. Make sure they don't do their shockwave move because it's guaranteed to knock you off. Which is pretty annoying. Charge up again, and ah. Okay, only 20 more seconds. So we got this, no problem at all. Oh, crap. oh, I got lucky there. You should still, even if the shockwave hits you, you should still make it back onto the platform if you're, you know, like um, in the very middle, then you're safe. So that should be the fifth bow crown of the game, I think. Let's see. Yep, that's the fifth, alright. Alright, so well, we're gonna have to fall to, fall down to the bomb in order to get back up, looks like. Practically I have no choice. Okay, maybe it would've been smart for me to land in the water so he wouldn't take any damage, but still, that's okay. We got plenty of hits to spare, so it doesn't matter. Okay, for once, why don't we at least put the homing ammo to use, because I'm pretty sure uh, Funky gave, gave us homing ammo for a good reason actually start using it on the enemies. That'd be nice. <clears throat> okay, 
89, and 90. So we got 10 more of Diddy Kong's bananas. I'm not totally sure where they are, but we'll just have to wait and see. But hopefully we're not missing any. Also, next we're going to get Chunky out. And there's also another area that you're not supposed to access until nighttime, but we're going to do it anyways. I mean, unless it's nighttime, not necessarily until. See that area down there? Well, that's where that's where Chunky's Kasplat is, okay? And there's, I think the last of his bananas are also down there. So, using the same technique we, we did with Diddy Kong, we can still get down there even though it's daytime. So we're basically, this is kind of a glitch here. But it's so obvious, I don't know why the game didn't think you were going to catch that. And there we go. Oh no! We still got 15 more of Chunky's bananas. And I have no idea where they are either. There's going to be a problem with that. Oh wait, no, I might have an idea. Oh! Well, there's the last of Diddy Kong's bananas. Okay, so we're in the clear. So I guess we're gonna get Diddy Kong out. And also, we're gonna be using that barrel of his for a mission anyway, so... And I think this should be his very last mission, so... So we're gonna finish off Diddy Kong in this episode, it looks like. Okay, now we got the last of his bananas, and we got us to splat, and now his last mission is at the very top of the mushroom, at the very, very top. There's a banana barrel here. So let's go inside and see what game we're playing. Welcome it's to Teetering Street. Turtle Trouble, which as we know is no problem at all. Okay, very simple minigame. No matter how hard the variation gets, it's always easy for me. And I don't really know anyone who struggles at this anyway, so... This is a very easy minigame to generate for Supposedly, it is. Just follow the same pattern that I do. You know. See, if you keep following this pattern, it should be no problem at all. It's cakewalk, practically. Wouldn't that be funny if I actually failed at that? And after saying, you know, how easy it is and stuff like that, that'd be so hilarious. But, too bad it's not gonna happen. <coughs> Although I was pretty close there. But still, too bad. Okay, so, with the exception of his blueprint, we are officially done with Diddy Kong for Fungi Forest. So next, while we're still up here, let's get Chunky out again, because there's a mission for him right here. It's pretty, pretty obvious what we have to do there anyways. So Chunky has one more chance to shine before we end off this episode. Okay, so what you have to do in here is, first things first, you have to... Um, let's get rid of this... Get rid of that stupid bee over there. And it looks like, yep, the last of his bananas are in fact in here. So let's get the last of his bananas, and then we'll get his last golden banana. Okay. So, what we have to do here is... We have to make the puzzle look exactly like it did. I mean, the picture, not the puzzle. We have to make the picture look exactly like it did before we hit the switch. So, basically, we have to make a picture of Chunky. Shouldn't be too hard, though. We'll watch this and we'll screw it up right away. doing just fine so far. We got it. 
you look closely, you will notice that it, that it actually follows a, a puzzle. I mean, no, a pattern, more like. <clears throat> but now we're done with Chunky, 100% in Fungi Forest. And with that, we are ready to end off this episode, okay? And so... Oh, okay, um, first of all, this, these next two weeks, um, I will not be uploading two episodes a day, okay? I'm going to record 12 episodes a day as usual, you know, like I normally do, but I'm not going to upload them all in one week, okay? Simply because I'm not going to have time to record next weekend, because it's going to be Thanksgiving weekend, so I'll be really busy, you know, hang out with my family, you know, all that other good stuff, so... I will not be able to record next weekend, so for the next two weeks, you guys will see um, only one episode a day, so don't freak out. You know, it doesn't mean them, you know, cutting back on them slacking off in the LP. It's just that I practically, you know, I'm not going to record any more than 12 episodes, so. But that's going to be it for episode 55, so thank you for watching. Let's play. Oh, uh, yeah, the. Episode 55, Multiclass Gamer, signing out. Bye.